Hi guys. Welcome back to my channel everyone. I hope you guys are having a great day. I am so excited for this video for a couple reasons. Um, number one, it's a beach vlog, which I think it's the first beach vlog on my channel, which I'm so excited about. Um, this video is also sponsored by Brooklinen, which I'm so humbled about if I'm being totally honest. I've actually purchased their sheets in the past because of like videos that, I see, that I've seen and their sheets are in incredible um so i just got my package in the mail i'm about to make my bed and put my new sheets on in a minute and i'm so excited um but we'll get to that in a sec but yeah this is like the first official beach vlog on my channel hang on i need chapstick um it's like 7 45 right now and i woke up about like an hour and a half ago this is also the first summer that i'm like actually vlogging down to the beach i also just have to like get in the swing of vlogging around other people you guys know that like i rarely leave my house when i vlog and it's like awkward for me to vlog around other people so just bear with me as i like warm in like warm up into this which is so funny because i've done youtube for like years but whatever anyway yeah let's put the sheets on my bed and then we'll get into it <laughs> Before I totally finish like dressing the rest of my bed, I just want to show you the sheets really quick. These, they're a little wrinkled from the dryer. That's my fault, but I sprayed um, like a de wrinkle on them and it'll like de wrinkle out. But these are just like so luxurious. They feel so incredible. They are so soft. I wish you guys could like feel them for yourself. I love the color. I just went with cream. It's a really cute color. And then I just have um, like normally when I sleep at night, I just throw this off and I normally just sleep under this sheet because it's like really hot right now at the beach. And this is just so luxe and so gorge. Like, look at this. So again, this video is sponsored by Brooklinen and I just feel so honored to work with Brooklinen. Um, I got the Lux Hardcore Bundle. Let me show you what else it comes with. It also comes with these. Um, I don't have a... If you have a duvet, they also have a duvet cover with the Lux. We have these in some of the other rooms, so I'm going to put this duvet cover on one of the guest rooms that we have here. I also wash mine right before I put them on because Brooklinen is known for like every time that they wash their sheets, um, they get more comfy and I wanted like maximum comfort for my fresh new pair of sheets. So I threw them in the washer before and I just put them on. High quality sheets are known to be really, really expensive, like obscenely expensive, but Brooklinen has really reduced costs by completely cutting out the middleman and these sheets are incredibly affordable. Brooklinen was founded on the philosophy that you guys deserve luxury without the luxury price tag. Brooklyn is also offering my viewers a discount i'm going to have the link to it down below um it's also on the screen here but if you guys want to try out brooklyn in for yourself um you guys can get 20 dollars off your order over a hundred dollars using my code tori simone at checkout to me having like the right sheets is a non-negotiable we spend a third of our life sleeping and i want to make sure that when i go to sleep i'm comfortable and especially down here at the beach i want something that's very light and very breathable yet something that is super comforting and it's kind of hard to find all of that and i find that the luxe 
Deluxe collection from Brooklinen is exactly that. And if I were to find sheets like similar to this, they'd be like around $500, but depending on your bed, these are a fraction of the cost coming out to like around 250, again, depending on the size of your bed, which to me is a great deal. What's also really cool is that sheets are such a fun way to switch up how your room looks, how your apartment looks, how your house looks and you can mix and match your sheets to have like custom colors and pick out what works best for you and for your room. Like back home, I have black sheets and I love having black sheets. I think it is like really, really cool. It makes a really cool statement. And here, because it's more like beachy, I have cream sheets. So it really goes with my theme, what I have going on, my mood, my vibe. I just really love mix and matching sheets and it makes it like a really customized look and it's a cool way to do some design. Instead of mix and matching, like I need this pillowcase and I need this top sheet, you can do the bundle like what I did with the Lux Hardcore bundle and it comes with everything that you need. The Lux Hardcore bundle comes with the cover sheets which covers the mattress and it's a top sheet. It also comes with a duvet cover and pillowcases for the pillows and extra pillowcases as well. The Lux is made from sateen fabric sheets which means that you're gonna get that buttery, soft feeling that's nice and comforting all year round which is perfect for any time that you are in bed. Shopping for my Brooklyn and Sheets was also really easy and really, really fun. You can mix and match a bunch of colors. You can choose what bed size you need. Um, the online process was incredibly easy and took only a couple minutes and I felt like I was like really an interior designer when I was doing it. You can mix and match over 20 different colors and patterns across the board of the classic collection, the Lux collection, of your duvet cover, pillowcases, top sheets, whatever you need to make your perfect bundle for you. You can do that all online. Something that happens with me when I sleep down here is I tend to get like really hot at night and after sleeping in my Brooklyn and Sheets, I do not like wake up sweaty from sleeping and none of my clothes like catch on the sheets either, which is really, really important to me. I just get such good sleep. Like I said, they get so after every single time you wash them, so like wash day for sheets is something that I used to dread, but I now look forward to it. I could not adore these sheets more. And again, if you guys want to try Brooklyn for yourself, use code Tori D. Simone to get $20 off an order of over $100. And you guys will see why me and literally everyone else is so obsessed with Brooklyn in. So now that my bed is so perfectly made, I am going to head to the studio. Um, I'm just going to change really quick. And I think I'm also going to straighten my hair. I don't know. It's really pretty. But honestly, like when I sweat and when my hair is like natural and it's not like styled in any way, it just becomes a hot mess. I also have um, laundry to put away. So I'm going to be putting away laundry today. And... Yeah, I'll catch you guys in a little bit. My screen has been so dark lately and I'm not sure why. I think I messed up the setting when I took this in to film a couple spin classes. But I need to see if I need a sweatshirt or not. Oh God, no. Oh, it's gorgeous out. Gorge. So apparently it's supposed to storm today. Um, I'll believe it when I see it honestly oh really oh of course you really are vlogging today you got the you got the magic set on and everything isn't this cute yes I love that we should get that story they sent so it to me cute. thanks story oh wait Kate you should show the people your fave alcoholic bevy of choice okay so I just tried these for the first time the other day Alani, I've never even had like a normal Alani, or what are they called? Um, Alani new, like energy, Alani new drink. energy drink. Never had one before, but I tried these spiked seltzers. They, um, I tried the lemonade ones. Tastes like lemonade. Dangerously like lemonade, but delicious. Uh, Hawaiian shaved ice. This is what I'm gonna try next. Not right now, obviously. <laughs> um, raspberry mojito. Great flavors. Uh, sit back and relax. They said it first. They sent it to me in PR and I had it shipped here because I knew that we would drink it down here at the beach. And Katie has just been loving them. They're literally just like little juice. And I'm not normally a super sweet drink kind of person. And you're not a seltzer drinker. Not a seltzer drinker at all. I'm stri strictly bruised. And... Cool girl alert. Seriously. Pick me. <laughs> and... Those are those are really good. I really like them. I think it's because they're refreshing. I'm having a Nutri-Grain bar. Have you had one of these since elementary school? All right, let me get my card. Just in case I want to go get something. Okay, we are playing Strictly Harry Styles.
gorgeous. There's the beach. What a day. So gorgeous. Thanks. Thanks. So cute. Now you're in my life. I can't get you off my mind. Bye. Bye. Back from the studio. Um, I'm gonna make some breakfast real quick. It's like about 11. I have a call at 11.30 and then another one at two. I wanna work on some planner stuff today and I have to record my podcast today. If I don't get to my podcast today, it's no big deal. I can just do it tomorrow. Um, but I'd like to get it done today, but we'll see how talkative I am later. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna make breakfast. I think I'm just gonna do like eggs and toast and strawberries. But I think I'm gonna lay out while I take my call. Kate. Yeah. Do you unplug the toaster? What? Do you unplug the toaster? No. Someone unplugs it. Um. Probably my mom. Not sure. These English muffins are left over from batch. Where'd they go? I threw them away because they're stale. Oh. Oh, oh! I didn't know that was there. <laughs> you don't see that. Oh my god, I'm so scared. I'm gonna pee my pants. I'm gonna pee myself. <laughs> you literally see just like the fear of God in my eyes. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I'm literally gonna pee. Kate, what's on your agenda today? Um usual find jobs, do some training. I'm learning how to use Salesforce. Whatever that is. She's gonna be a working girl, everyone. One of these days. I had strawberries, but I actually ate them before I was ready. Okay, I just had my meeting. It was so great. And now I'm up on the rooftop deck and I'm gonna tan, I'm in a bathing suit right now. I'm gonna tan while I do some work. Well, really just like sit outside while I do some work. But I wanna show you guys how I do my work. So it's actually the funniest thing ever. And I posted this last year and everyone went crazy. So this is called a lap dome. My mom got this on Amazon, but this is like the website. And it's a laptop tent so that you can do your work outside on a laptop. And it's like, hang on, let me show you how it works. It's like the best thing ever. You just put this, it's on my lap. Like there's my bathing suit, it's on my lap. And now I can just see everything that I need to do. And it's all in here. So I'm just going to um, work on some emails, plan out my podcast that I'm gonna record later today. How you doing, Kate? Doing all right, no complaints. I will say that. This is my grill bathing suit. It's so tiny, um, but nobody can see me from up here. So this is my safety suit. Safety suit. Safety suit. So you know it's hot. I'm literally dripping in sweat. gonna be like terrible Katie footage? No. Good. Um, it is literally so hot up here. It is hot. My hair is like sticking. I'm gonna stay out for a little bit longer. I actually have to send in some of my tax returns. Oh my Gosh. god, look at how much sweat is on this chair. It's so freaking hot out. Tonight we're having movie night and I think we're watching Shutter Island tonight. I don't even know what that's about. Uh, Leonardo DiCaprio is in it. That's all I know. And it's supposed to storm later but there's literally not a single cloud in the sky. So I wonder how that's gonna work when those clouds will start to roll in. Apparently four, we'll see. We'll see. Um, I have therapy in like 20 minutes. And then after that, I'm finishing my tax returns. Should be doing that now, but it's fine. Finishing tax returns and then um, filming my podcast. And then I'm supposed to film a haul today, but worst case scenario is I can do that tomorrow. But I really should do it today. Um, but it's fine if I don't. And I wanna work on my planners today. And that's it. I need water, I need to put sheets on my bed. 
You just said water. Okay, I'm coming in. And this is starting to burn my throat. Hurry, hurry, it's hot. Okay, so next on our daily agenda is I need to fill up my water and I bought cherries the other day. So I'm gonna bring some cherries up with me while I talk to my therapist. I also need to put laundry away. I have some things to do today, don't I? I can't do Oh wait, I also wanna try out this hack that I saw on Instagram. Apparently, if you cut these in half, then you can just, I feel like I'm gonna get juice in my eye. Mm. Oh yeah, it kind of worked. All right, let me try again. There we go. That one worked. Look how easy that is. Mm. It's now later. I recorded my podcast and I did that outside, which was nice. And now I'm trying to connect to this speaker. We've been in the biggest hairstyles kick all day. Wait, Madison, how did my vlog? Hi, vlog. <laughs> Happy Thursday. Um, it's girls' night, best night. God, I don't know how to uh, do this. Tell the people what you did today. Nothing. I did a whole lot of nothing. I got my nails done, took spin. Yeah. Ocean. Maddie declared blue um, the color of the summer. What? Groundbreaking. Uh, yeah. Song. Everyone hop on. You already here first. Who's So it's about 6 a.m. right now and I have Pilates at 7.30. So I'm walking to the studio right now. It's about a two and a half mile walk from my house. So not crazy. And yesterday I did a four and a half mile walk and it was awesome. Felt like so good. So yeah, I'm just walking right now to the studio. This is my Lulu belt bag. I get so many questions about it every time I use it. So I'll link it below. But yeah, I'm gonna keep walking. Just about made it. It's 6.53, I wanted to get here at seven. That was a 48 minute walk, 2.5 miles. It was a great walk, now I'm on the promenade. Um, so I was on the beach and the promenade and the studio is right up here in those buildings. Um, I am at Pilates, it's at 7.30. I had a time to get the sound system set up and get that working. It's still off the season. So, well, technically it's the season because it's in Memorial Day weekend, but the beginning of June is personally my favorite time down at the beach, um, but it's also like the quietest time down at the beach because a lot of kids are still in school, but this is like the last week 
so starting next week like more families will come down but it really starts like after Father's Day down here. Oh, sorry my hair's everywhere but yeah I'm just getting to the studio now and I'll vlog when I'm in there. Thanks, Maddie. Okay, so I just finished up at the studio with Maddie and Allie. Hi. About Hello. to leave. My mom's here to pick me up on the golf cart because I walked here and I don't feel like walking home. Um, I could have also just went home with Kate, I realized, but whatever, this is better. All right, bye, guys. See you, See you, later. See you later. Hey, Mom. Thanks for the ride. Sure. Look at the service I get, everybody. All right, guys, I'm back in my room. Um, it's 10 a.m. Can't believe it's only 10 a.m. I feel like I've lived like 10 lives today. Um, so now. I have my to-do list today, so today I have to film this morning routine. Um, I'm going to work on my planners. I have a promise to myself to create um, like two spreads a day for my planners, um, and I will have more updates on that soon. I know I've been saying that, but it's really not just as easy as like creating a product and then putting it out there. There's a lot that goes into it, especially because I don't just see this being a one-time product. Like I want this to become a company and it takes time to build that. So I know it might look like I'm doing nothing for these planners, but I do a lot of work for them. Um, so I have dedicated like two pages a day. Um, and if I do more than that, great, but I do nothing less than two pages a day. So I'm doing my two planner pages. Um, I'm going to design and order some new merch today. I think I'm going to get like tumblers. Every year um, we do crew necks like this. So I think I'm going to do like a yellow color this year and um, maybe a tank top, but maybe not. But yeah, nothing like crazy today. So this is where I put my phone on do not disturb and I'm unavailable and I'm going to work on my planner pages until I get two spreads done. Let me show you guys what I've done. Just that. Just that. So let me like explain my problem. This is edition like five of the times that I've redone the planner. This is the planner. Like it's been done for a while now. Like this is like a daily spread, like a two day daily spread. This is a weekly setup, a week at a glance. Like it's been done. Okay, for a while now. But my problem is, and I talk about this on the podcast a lot, is that I am like very about reinvention. And I want to exhaust every single possibility of this planner before it goes to print. So what happens is I'll create the planner and then I'll live with it. Like I'll use it, I'll print it out, I'll put it on my iPad, whatever, I'll use it. And then I figure out what I like, what I don't like, and what I want to change entirely. So I'm making a new weekly spread right now and I'm trying this one out and I like it a lot so far. Actually, I need to bring those down and that's what's throwing me off. And I like what I have a lot right now. There's just a lot more that I want to fit on this. Oh, and I spaced this all wrong actually. I have to fit in a whole other column. Oh no. Yeah, the spacing of this is really off right now and I have to totally redo this, but I think I'm just gonna walk away for a little bit, gather my thoughts, put on a bathing suit, lay outside, and edit my video. I already did what I needed to do today. That's the thing. Like, that's why this is just taking me so long, is just because I just want it to be exactly how I picture it and I want it to be right. So I just made a coffee. I didn't have one yet today. Man, does it taste good. Um, the secret is iced coffee with any kind. It honestly doesn't really matter. Maybe to some people, but not to me. I just use whatever we have. You could also just make it like iced just by pouring it over ice, but I always find that it just gets diluted. So I just buy it 
like iced coffee that you keep in the fridge and then Chobani sweet cream creamer and that's it it is like so good it literally tastes like a milkshake every day it is so freaking good so i brought out my kindle but i'm actually gonna finish the podcast episode that i was listening to with um and my lead on the skinny confidential and then once i've done that i'm honestly probably gonna buy his book but i'm probably gonna buy an audiobook and listen to it as i do walks this week so i'll probably listen to it as i can but i'm gonna lay out for a little bit and then i'll grab my laptop a little bit later and edit my video forgot to vlog I just got back from the beach obviously I just took a shower and this is too tall that's better and my dad and I were gonna go get a drink but I forgot my ID here and my card like my wallet and he didn't have his wallet with him either so we just came back and then we were gonna like leave again to go get a drink but I was like you know what if I'm coming home I'm freaking showering because I my hair was like a giant knot it was like disgusting so um i showered feel so much better my legs got like a little toasty today like a little bit burnt like they'll be fine in the morning but actually they're pretty much like fine right now but they're just like a little red all right guys i'm gonna end today's video i hope you guys all enjoyed it i want to thank you guys so much for watching and I want to give a special shout out to Brooklyn. And again, thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Again, you guys can use code Tori D. Simone at checkout and get $20 off an order over $100 and get some amazing sheets for yourself. It's also a really great present for Father's Day that's coming up. Just a thought. Um, but yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I'll be doing tons more vlogs. So let me know what you guys want to see. And I hope you guys have a great day. I'll talk to you guys on my next video. Bye, guys.